you saw what was called a push-in ceremony. It's an old tradition. It uh, dates back to whenever there's horse-drawn uh, fire pumpers. And what they would do is when they switched out pumpers uh, with the horse-drawn, they would uh, actually wash the new one and then they would push it back into the station so they could bring the horses in front of it so it was ready to go in service. It's, it's a tradition we just follow. Well, it, it provides us really a really safe apparatus that can respond quickly to the neighborhood, this community out here in South Tulsa. But also it's safe for our firefighters because it's brand new. The truck it's replacing is actually 21 years old. Um, it's just the way the system works right now. Everything is going up in price. This is a $1.4 million apparatus. Uh, we have to work through the city system to purchase these. And we try our best to stay in new apparatus, but sometimes it doesn't work out. The mayor and the city council, they do a great job of helping us fund these, but a lot of times we just have to deal with what we got. So when you think about that 21-year-old uh, apparatus, sometimes it's not as reliable, so it doesn't mean we're going to get to the scene. That means we're training our trucks. The reliability just wasn't there, and we're at the end of its service life. So to get this new one is really, really a good benefit for us and the community.